And time to get the coffee. <laughs> yeah, what's up? Uh, how, how are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? Oh, I'll share it with you. Oh, that's your screen. That's weird. Never seen that before. But how, how are you guys doing? I'm setting all this up. Uh, yeah, so there was a little time difference. Um, and yesterday I... You know, I had to help my mom out because I had no idea that that was happening. And I was like, oh, my God. So I needed to do the uh, sun thing and, and help her out. So, yeah, yeah, I keep 100. It's just it's just a lot. You know what else it is, too? The damn, the house that I was in. And guys, please, please remember this. If you live in an old house and there's might be mold in it, you got to wipe down totes and stuff. Because we started to like just feel kind of crappy at first, and then we're like, "Oh my god, a lot of this stuff has mold in it. No wonder." <laughs> so we've been doing that, and just please, like, mold is a very, very serious thing, uh, you know. And I'll just say, just please, uh, definitely be careful when it comes to that. Um. Okay. So. I'm going to show, I, I, I got that vid that Rev did. I want to uh, talk about that. I did see G-Man come in. I know he has another obligation tonight. Hopefully he can come in. I mean, it's not, it's nobody's fault. Uh, you know, uh, we were to do something today or yesterday. And then he had to change some stuff around. And then that happened with my mom. So I, of course, had to go help. So... I'm sure if he can tonight, uh, hopefully in another time, but uh, hopefully he can just show up for a couple minutes because I still have questions about the uncle and stuff. I'm really, really, uh, I'm just curious about, does he even understand like what's going on, like that they get talked about all the time and stuff like that. But here, while I'm, uh, while I'm setting up here, hold on, let me just, video there you go Ooh. um so yeah so there's that and i heard his video and i was really uh i was really really uh surprised i don't know why i always get brought up into everything with these people i'm not even doing anything like irl you know i i've sent some emails big deal but i've not sent letters to anybody or her their house or anything like that because I'm not about that, folks. I am not about that. Oh, and it's so, you know, hey, it's raining over there in Pennsylvania, I hear. So at least, you know, at least she gets a shower today, right? <laughs> but yeah, how how is everyone doing? I hope everyone's been having a a nice a good a nice uh time or a nice, you know, a nice couple of days. So I'm just trying to get something together but yeah folks i just been you know doing my thing and trying to trying to make sure i keep everything together <laughs> it's a lot so like i said like before i understand rev struggles i really really do but even that even said like it's i I moved and it took me a week. And yes, I know they took them a far distance. Well, I went a far distance as well. And I still was renting trucks and stuff. And that's just, I think that's just what you, you know, need to do. But uh, hold on, I'll, I'll just let you guys talk up a second. Um, hmm. Sorry, I was just trying to find a good... Uh, It sounds like you need to take some like me. Eh, you know what it is? Like I said, I just been going. Oh, I just I just been going and, and and cleaning up now bins all night last night. Got there, I helped my mom out, just trying to spray them down and everything, and make sure that uh, make sure that they were clean and all that. Hmm. 
Yeah, so I'm I'm looking for Ah, oh, here we go. Okay, so well I wanna show I'm gonna show that rev video and just a little bit of a little bit of what you call it. It's a little bit of receipts. Uh I heard that I I I bring stuff out of context and stuff like that. And I, I don't feel like it's it's their context, right? It's their life, their context. So how can I bring something out of context? And that's one thing that bothered me because like, I don't, you know, I, I don't feel like I do that. But here, let's, uh, let's uh, start with this. Thank you all for being here. Yes, please like the stream. And let's rate, let's uh, let's de let's debunk these people together. Here we go, folks. Thank you all for being here. Come on, Rev. Oh. Oh, ha 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 ha. ha. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just gonna pause that. But hey, guys, thank you. Hey, Scott. Hey, That's CC. Chest right now is hey, Debbie. Uh, hey, June. What's up, Chef Angelo? Okay. So I guess the way I should start this is with the story. Okay. Because, uh, yeah, I, I helped them out, Jilly's mom. It was like, like six thousand dollars. I felt really, really bad, but I had my, you know, my mom was here to help us out and get a lot of the stuff done at our place. So it's just, you know, I had to do it. But I felt extremely bad that they had to like change this this uh water sewer main or something like that i don't know it was in the basement but it kind of flooded so i was helping them just clean that area up because that's kind of what happened in my old house and then a bunch of mold just showed up and god we all we all got sick but uh yeah and then a guy came and it would cost six grand to uh replace and i just you know i felt i needed to help out i've been feeling this way for a long time because like we've been in this situation we hey Rebecca, what's up? <laughs> with the online trolling and stuff for quite some time. Hey Shamu, I'm so always I late. I've been <laughs> feeling this way for probably uh, at least like a year, maybe longer than that, because you know when the heat got turned up with with this trolling and crap, uh, mm -hmm. that's basically when this time. Hey Sydney, I'm one hundred with <laughs> random people you know strange women uh contacting me in my email with a clear intention for me of wanting to break me up with with shannon who is my wife we lived in colorado for years with the understanding with the state that we were married now, like I explained in a response to one of these strange women that contacted me in my email, um, just because I moved to a different state that has different standards for what they consider quote-unquote marriage, that does not nullify the fact that I am married to Shani. Oh, it does it. Well, you know what, folks? Hey, check this out. Just check this out. Uh, no longer allowed. Yes, no longer allowed. As soon as those idiots set foot in Scranton, Pennsylvania, they were no longer common law married. Common law married means really nothing. It was an old, this is old, old laws, folks. No one even follows these anymore. This is not the 80s. So, no, you are not allowed in the eyes of the law. But again, maybe if you one day, instead of begging $30 for Delta 8, beg $25 to go to a, a courthouse 
and get the marriage certificate. And then you could say you're married. You know, when she's Shani uh, Egroff, th then you're all golden, man. Or whatever she wants to be. But she's Shani ex-husband's last name. So, you know, just want to show that debunk so we could put that to rest. Because that one's definitely bothering me. Oh, we're married. Yeah. No, you're married in your own damn mind. <laughs> But she knows that because she also said in the email, you don't have to be fake loving her anymore and this stuff. And that is what really triggered me and wanted me to do a video <clears throat> addressing uh -huh. this type of stuff. Because it's extremely invalidating to say to a person that they are fake hey, loving someone cheese. with no proof. And hey, okay, uh... Well, you, you guys aren't married. Even Jilly's mom says right here, they weren't in Colorado either. You have to to live together for six years for it to be considered married. There you go. There you go. And you have absolutely no reason to say this. Absolutely none. Zero. Oh, hey, Mr. Unite. What's you up? You have no reason to assume that when I say I love Shani, it's fake. Hey, you know what, Miss you know, you would definitely would definitely have some sort of paperwork. So, and I don't understand why they keep this that grift going that they're that they're married. It's common law married. They had so much money to do it, but we know why, folks. Right? Up until the children left, it was because Rev had money. Shani was on the food stamps. Remember the food stamps, uh, Rev? You know, on Tyrone, or was that out of context too? You know, that people are pieces of crap that get food stamps. But then Shani had them the whole time. Once the kids are gone out of the equation, there seriously is no reason. Unless, folks, unless, unless you have to remember. The only reason why Rev would not, or Shani would not marry, want to marry Rev, or vice versa, is the work program. And what's the work program? Well, hey, I'm glad you asked. I will tell you. <laughs> the work program is if Shani, if Rev wanted to be in those kids' life lives, if there was any hope of reunification for Shani, Rev would have to do a work program. And we all know Rev does not want to work. So he'd rather do this common law bullshit than to try to um, get custody of the kids, maybe adopt them, anything like that. Oh, sorry, that was my alarm. <laughs> so just clearing that up there. It's, you have no reason to believe that, none. But <laughs> yeah. it's triggering to keep hearing this over hey, and over Patty. again because – it, it almost becomes reality. Well, everybody knows Rev it, uh, like is not in love with Shani. It becomes that because of so many, an echo chamber of trolls. It's the truth, Debbie. Thing over and over again. And it's just it, repetition. Saying something over and over again does not make it true. That That's what Nazi propagandists do. Oh, okay. is it? And we know that you are the arbiter of all that, that the concerns stuff like that, Rev. And that's what they're doing. And it's all in in uh, an effort to make you hate Shani for their devices, to make super chats and clicks and I think something deeper too. Oh my God. Here, here's Rev the conspiracies. All right, so uh, this never happened. Honey, you need to get back on the highway. I wanted to check on him. Is he? Because you see. Can him? we go park somewhere? So you guys can hear that, right? So we're not like in the middle of traffic. Can you fucking use your fucking head and get off the side of the goddamn road and go down and park somewhere smart? What a loving couple, folks, right? What a loving couple. I'm sure you wish you had a, 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 a girlfriend just like it. <laughs> Sorry, that makes you laugh. Get the cat on your lap, you fucking idiot. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, folks. I'm, this That's out of context. He just called that autistic that, uh, boy, a shanty son, uh, an effing idiot. But I'm sorry. That's out of context. Can tell, keep telling us 
uh, Rev, about how everything is out of context. Um, but I am. I'm really sick of it. I'm sick of people telling me how I feel. Because that's not a thing. When I'm telling you my feelings, I have no reason to lie about what I'm saying. If I were miserable in my marriage, you would probably hear about it in some way. Oh, uh, um, like this? Mm -hmm. If he's on that floor again, you are getting your ass beat. Like, you mean like 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 that? Like beat like 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 threatening a like threatening a, a child with autism, right? You would hear something like that. I'm telling you, when I, I I talk about my relationship, it's always positive because I feel that way. Okay, I have a good relationship with Shani. Yes, fo folks, folks, we can't mess around. He has a good relationship with Shani. How dare me or anybody else show any type of proof or receipts otherwise? Oh wait, what's this? Spit on me too. Yeah, you deserve. After you fucked me yesterday. <laughs> Yeah. I wish I could rip my fucking thing off after it being in you. Yeah. It's sterile and disgusting after being in you. Wow. Who the fuck would want to fuck me after that? Wow. It's true. Yeah. Yeah, real real nice relationship they have there, huh? Can't you hear the love? <laughs> normal, good relationship. Yeah. Of love. It's love, folks. Love for one another. So, like, what I'm telling you is not unhealthy. Like, I'm telling you that what, at its core, our relationship is based on God and Jesus and, which is the same thing, but, you know, uh, love. <laughs> so stop telling me it's not love, because that's invalidating to me. Oh. As a human being. You're, it's abusive to say to me what you're... Oh, what, Rev, what you think, what you're experiencing, you think, you just think. Right, Lori, right. they're so in love. I mean, even G-Man did to that to me. <laughs> Rip it off. like, oh, I know you're in love. Yeah, you're in love. You can't even see stuff. That's invalidating. That's like telling me that, that there's stuff going on in front of my face and I'm too mentally ill or whatever or Yes, yes, thank you, folks, folks. He finally, he, Rev finally got here. Yes, yes. And, and Rev, and, and, you know, you can name drop me all day. I love that, you know, that you love that. You know, I know you guys like the channel. You know why? I'll tell you guys right now why Rev likes my channel so much. Because me, like you guys, he, they both think I'm hilarious as hell, too. So they watch this stuff laughing. Because Shani has told me like <laughs> two years ago, so they think it's as, as hilarious as you guys. Um, but yeah, I believe Rev. Yes, you don't understand. And this is not a grift. This is not me trying to make up anything to look good and have you look bad. This is the damn truth. She's manipulating you. She doesn't have cancer. She doesn't have a biopsy. And she hasn't set that up, but every time she talks about cancer, you get all upset and scared. You know why? Because she's manipulating you, bro. And you, you're, you're too, you're too close to it. Okay. If you won't want to say that, it, you know, it's mental illness or you're too dumb. No one's saying that, but I'm saying you're just too close to it. How about that, Rev? You're just too close to that. Does that, is that better? Uh, however they want to frame it. Uh, and I can't be objective, right? Because I have like, you know, Stockholm syndrome or something like they tried to say about William and, and, and the boys. It's insane. This stuff that's psychologically abusive, you're trying to put something on me that's not me. I'm telling you that I'm and in. Me. Huh? And, me. and you. Yeah. But this is mainly, but I like I'm addressing specifically like emails and this type yeah. stuff. You know, okay. They obviously do this to you too. But when it's directed at me, it's always break them up, break them up, get put doubt in his head. You don't really love her. It's a, you're not experienced in this stuff. You're not.
Well, dude, you're not. It was Shani and a real doll. Like there was no, <laughs> nothing else kind of came with this. It was it was Shani and a doll. You are not experienced in this. You are getting manipulated left and right, man. Come on, you can't even eat anything besides a big jar of Jif peanut butter and your granola bars. And you even know that. That's why you have little Freudian slips here and there. That's the real Rev coming out. And Rev, I bet, I bet sometimes, you know, you do want to drink because you never dealt with why you drank in the first place. And I, I'm just saying you should. You should talk to some AA people or, or, you know, go to an AA meeting and just try to, you know, by yourself, obviously, because Shane does not understand. And just talk about what's happening. See what they say. Random people that don't even know the situation about the internet. Just people just, you know, and make it as vague as possible. You know, with, with women and stuff. So you just think you love her. It's not real love. That is abusive. <laughs> right. <laughs> and it's invalidating. And I, and I just needed to talk about it. It's, it's, and, and I, I feel bad. Hey, strong girl, what's up? Too, Cause she needs to see this shit. I don't want it. So stop it. Just don't send me emails. If it's going to be in the vein of Shani's abusive, you, you don't know it's abuse, blah, blah, blah. And you need to get out. Just stop that. Okay. Rev, rev, rev. <laughs> rev, rev, wine. Why do you make this so easy? You're just mean. You're just mean just to be yeah, mean. I don't care. I know you don't care. You I don't care don't. about you me. You spent all my money. I do, no, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. I was literally telling you stop yep. buying this stuff when we knew Would the money I was wrong. Would I be moving around, around if your ass didn't come to me in, in, in fucking Pennsylvania from Minnesota when you pushed yourself into my life? Oh, I pushed you in. Yes, you Hmm. Now, folks, 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 now, I, I don't know about you guys, but to me, I don't see this as me taking a clip out of context, you know, to suit my needs for Super Chats and all that stuff. I don't. I'm showing what they deleted and showing it to you all as what we call proof or receipts of why we feel the way we feel. That's it. I'm not making anything up. I'm not saying that her, his uncle's name is Joey. I'm not showing his address, you know, doxing them. I'm not doing anything like that. I am just showing what they say on stream, which they delete very, very quickly after. Yeah. Jason, you always say this when we get in a fight. And then you come back and say, I'm sorry I said all these no, things to you. Sorry yeah, right. Because no, you manipulate him, Shani. Good for you. You manipulate uh, a mentally ill man. Yeah, you're going to say sorry again. Yeah, because you're probably going to run at me and try and punch me and beat me like you did last You time. literally just... Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. What did he just... What did, what did Rev just say here? Oh, let me just, let me just uh, bring it back a little bit. You, you don't know it's abuse, blah, 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 and you need to get out. Just stop that, okay? Please. Because it's it's just not... I'm telling you, this is like... I'm, I'm putting a message out telling you how I feel about it. And if you really do care for me, I appreciate that you care for me. But I don't need that shit. Hmm. And neither does Shani. Yeah. I'm tired of being... You know, make all me I, the enemy. Yeah, and all I do is try to preach goodness and love. You do. Charity. I'm done with it. Sure, she it's does, folks. Yes. It's abusive to you. It's abusive to you to have people constantly coming at you with all these different railing accusations like Jesus said that they would do to the believers at the end. Oh, God, Rev. Railing accusations. Let me just remind us just a little bit, just a little bit. All we need is a little bit. A little dab will tell you, folks. Punch me and beat me like you did last time. You week. literally just tried to punch me. Did you see my oh. nose? No, to to you. Sorry, yeah, right. No, I'm not. Yeah, you're going to say sorry again. Yeah, because you're probably going to run at me and try and punch me and beat me like you did last You time. literally just tried to punch me. Did you see my nose, guys? Yep. Did you see my eyes? Yep. 
she punched the shit out of me. That's yep. a Okay, now I don't know how else to take that, folks. Maybe there's some mental illness wrong with me. And you know what? You know what? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I'll be the first to say, but you know what, Rev? At least I'll admit it. At least I'll admit it. What the hell is your excuse? You just said that. How the fuck can I take that any other fucking way? You know? But seriously. There's no way else you could take it. She beat the crap out of him. And then when she says no, he says, did you see my eyes? Did you see my this? A lie. That's a lie and you know lie? it. Is that a lie? Yes, it is. No, you're it's just, not you're a lie. Well, you just stop this, Jason. I was asking people for money and you turned this into this big fucking fight. And I know why. Because you're embarrassed because you haven't done anything to help your family out. You're just Ooh. mean. Ooh, that's, that's, that's Shani's projection. That's her projection. Shani loves to project. And because he said it. You beat me. You beat me off camera. You beat me like you did last You time. literally just tried to punch me. Did you see my nose, guys? Yep. Did you see my eyes? Yes. Hey, Sandra, what's she up? punched the shit out of me. That's yep. a lie. That's a lie and you know lie? it. Is that a lie? Yes, it is. You just, <laughs> you're, well, you just stop this, Jason. I was asking people for money, and you turned this into this big fucking fight. And I know why. Because you're embarrassed because you haven't done anything to help your family out. Oh, man. They make it easy, folks. Folks, they, they, they make it easy. But the one thing... Yeah, if you want to do stuff like this, you got to have the correct receipts and the right receipts. You know, receipts definitely go a long way when showing their hypocrisy. Please like. Reports and everything, which has happened. Uh, it, it's just part of the walk, I guess, at this time. It's part of the trial, honey. That, and that's, see, your reward is, is with Jesus, so. True. You know, your love. Thank you, baby. Yeah, and I love you deeply. And I love I, you too. Yeah, and I want you to always remember that. With the BS that you see in my emails. <laughs> I know that. Because you know I don't respond unless I show you everything I respond to. Yeah, exactly. You get what I'm saying? Like, you see it all. Same with you. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I know what you're doing too. <clears throat> Which is healthy. You know, because the internet's weird. It really yeah, and the internet is weird. We got weirdos talking about getting beat up in, the, in their eyes and face. We got boyfriends drop kicking kids in the face and stomach. Like, Rev, why'd you have to do that? Like, I get it. Shani threw a bag of Tostitos chips at your head because she didn't want to watch your, you know, um, devil's advocate. But still, it's called take a walk, bro. Take a walk. <laughs> you know? Like I could see a red flag from people with you, and I say, "Hey, honey, that guy, that person's weird," and you do the same thing with me. Like, "Hey, Jay, this chick's weird." <laughs> yeah, and I'm like, "Yeah, you're right." That's that. Every time, it's the <laughs> same tone. It's the same tone. We, we, yeah, we want this for you. Us, us. Yeah, who are you, we, us? Who is us and we? And for us, it would be them. Who is them? <laughs> you start sounding like a paranoid schizophrenic, but it's true, though. Why is there this collective out there? Like oh, my the God. Board? It's very weird, man. And there's women out there that, in my case, I'm, I'm taught... See, I made this to talk about me. I'm not leaving you out, Shani, at all. No. I'm talking about what I have been experiencing. Yo, he, Shani, he is so afraid of saying the wrong thing that Shani's going to get slappy. And he should, because we know how Shani is. One wrong thing, and Shani mutes the mic and... You know? <laughs> random you've never seen it's 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 pictures you've never seen of of random women and it's like this isn't good for you this is abuse don't you see it 
and blah, blah, blah. And then, uh, you know, whatever you need while well, I'm here, blah, blah, blah. Like this, it's clearly coordinated because my, on my Facebook and I got rid of that shit, it's gone. But it, you know, it, that it was flooded with this, the same type of profile over and over and over again. And I was like, what the hell is this? Are these bots or something? That's what I started thinking. I'm like being trolled by bots or something. But whatever. You know what that was about. It was very weird shit. And, and it was like, it was like all a game in my mind because I felt like it was like bot fake people. It was so weird. But I'm telling you, and I hope no one has to go through this because this is like low level celebrities stuff that you can get wrapped up in if you've been a streamer. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Because there's, I mean, Shani and I have been in a video, Shane Dawson, it's been viewed by like, I don't know, 25 million people. So when you have that kind of visibility, I mean, that's really when stuff kicked off. That's the, we got swatted the night that came out. I mean, When you're viewed by that many people, it, it will change things in your life. And I think we've experienced that. Like when Shanty goes out, there's inevitably somebody with a camera taking video. That happens. Okay, okay. All right. what, what, about, what about this video where Shanty was pleading for people to take care of her kids for her? So, I got no support system or anything. But it just... I need, I need, I need you guys' favor if something happens to me and if I die. Because I don't know how much longer I have left in this world. I really feel like I'm dying of a broken heart. Is this the weird people he was warning me about? If something bad happens to me, if I die, just make sure my sons go to my sister. Her wow. Name is Aaron McGraw Rorley. Uh, yeah, okay. Th thanks for the uh, thanks for the uh, uh, the docs there are on your own sister. That's probably why the kids aren't with her today. But who knows, Shani? Who knows what else you told your unfortunate sons about their aunt? Which that's messed up, man. Why can't they have a relationship with their family? Why do you gotta like poo poo that? I need them to go there. Hey, I'm the Donald, what's up? Even though she's not in my life. They'll be safe with her. They trust her enough with them. Hey, two of a kind, right? Right? But my life is not good. It's very lonely and isolated. This is the best. These, these cops, all this, they took away my only support. And now I have nothing. I have nothing. But tears and sadness and trying to put a mask on that everything's okay when it's not. Sandra Berger has just donated four euros through Super Chat. Oh, thank you, Sandra. I appreciate the, the four euros. <laughs> Man, but this this video yesterday, it was, it was wild. I'm like, I need to talk about this, even for a little bit, because it's just it's just too wild. I have too much stuff to debunk everything they say. I think they send them to Germany or something, because we're really popular in Germany. Germans love it. But uh, I, I just want people to know that if you actually do care for me and it's not just a ploy to get to Shani to make her feel bad, that I'm not, I'm never going to, you're never going to stop with that, are you? I could ask you to stop. All right. I could tell you that the reaction channels and, and like people like Draven's Crypt and those, those type of people <laughs> are lying about her. Okay, they give you. Okay, okay. Oh yeah, this this is the part where jerk off here talks about how I'm lying. How how am I lying? Um, how am I lying, Jason? I, I that's that's just what I'm. I'm very curious, folks. How am I lying? Well, hold on. Let, let me let me play a little bit more. I have another video <laughs> to interject with this. The uh, clips of her out of context. And you don't even understand what you're really hearing, but, oh, listen, she used this word or whatever. 
and you're just standing there going, okay, well, I guess that's bad. She used that word, which, which it is. Okay. Um, how about when she was abusing her children? Huh? How can I take this out of context, folks? I'm tired of being shown on the internet. And I don't understand why the kids are crazy right now. Out of context, anyway. folks. Motherhood is fantastic. My sons are turning into men and becoming big bullhards. So that's great. <laughs> When the hormones kick in, like William, he's... I mean, yo, your son is screaming. But again, uh, out of context, folks, I just don't get it. I'm not with the times. This is how people do it. And as far as uh, saying uh, racist things online, uh, you mean like this, Rev, when you came on my channel? He's a fat fucking bitch titted. What? What the fuck? He's a fat... Yeah, that is, is that what you're talking about? Like stuff like that? <laughs> Man, guys, make this harder for me, Rev and Shaney. Make this harder for me. It should not be this easy for me to debunk everything you guys say. So I'm just going to hate her. And then you just accept all the lies about her. Like for people like you, I'm requesting right, that you exactly. just leave us alone. And if you don't like Shannon, oh, hey, boo, what's up? then just don't watch her and leave her alone. It is Taylor. Who she is and let her do her live streams. Let her watch true crime or play a video game or talk to you guys. You know, that's really what she does. That's, that's the extent of her content for now. It will include cooking videos and all that cool stuff down the road. If, if the, you know, we get in a better place and stuff, uh, we'll be doing all that. But for now, that's what she does. Can, can we all just get along on that level and not get personal in, in, in false flagging wars and all this stupid stuff? Can we just exist independently? And then if you, want, if you have to do your reaction videos and make your super chats, yeah. okay, you're doing that and YouTube sees that that's okay. So you can do that, but can we exist too? Uh, you you guys can exist on Rumble all you want, but you literally, you guys are ban invading on YouTube after you both been banned. <laughs> so, and, but I'm not flat. I haven't flagged this, and I haven't told anyone to flag this because that's against terms of service. Those newer creators will find out really quick um, that you can't tell channels, even channels you don't like, to have your audience mass flag them you can't do that no matter what oh man <laughs> if you could i'd be doing it all day <laughs> hey yeah yeah kelly what's up Chris just got it i have to do dishes but we'll be listening okay awesome and thank you uh charlie for sponsoring again six months that is awesome. Super <laughs> to piss off. <laughs> Thanks, Charlie. Six months. Yo, thank you. That's, that's that. I can't, I can't even believe it's been six months of me actually having members and stuff. That's awesome. Thank you for reminding me. With you. This is like a plea from me. From Rex. Is it possible ha -ha. for us to coexist on this platform? and just get along and you can make your money and and we can make our money for our family could we do that no malice it, I, sure react reactions by their nature are going to be antagonistic or bullish if he's on that floor again you are getting your ass beat Oh, what's that, Red? Did you say something? I'm sorry. I, I, I think I just zoned out there. They are. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, I think all you guys acknowledge that that's the case. Unless you're somebody like Zachary Michael, who just reacts. He goes, oh, my God, girl, you know, stuff like that. Which I think he's cool. You know, he's, he's kind of funny and, and cool to watch. Uh, but, but I hate to say it, but somebody like, 
I don't know how where she's at now, but somebody like Charlie Gold or FG. Mm -hmm. that oh, thank you. Thank you, Senator Amidala. Senator Amidala has just donated $19.99 through Super Chat. Thanks for all you do. And thank you, Mods, for being so kind and welcoming. Yeah, uh, I got some good people here. But you know what, Senator Amidala, that's what having an actual, you know, um, having doing this for a while and kind of vetting people to be like, okay, this is a good mod. This ain't a good mod. This is a good mod. I got that. It took a, a couple of years, but I think I have a great system working here now and I have the right people and I, I am in love with them all and they are great people. So I thank my mods and I thank you for the 1999 uh, support. And I, and I'm glad that you found my channel as well. Thank you. Hey, what's up? Uh, oh, sorry. What's up, Vicky? Yeah, so uh, to that, I say, uh, hey, Rev. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? <laughs> I had to play that one. <laughs> gets into somebody's personal, everyday life for the reasons that they just want to get personal with someone. That's no. Okay. Let's not engage in that stuff. Let's not do that because at the end of the day, what YouTube is, is an entertainment platform. Otherwise, if you're in news, then you're... Oh, uh, Vicky, you love me. Let me express, just subscribe. Oh, thank you. Yo, 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 yo. I just want to say, I just want to say, I just want to throw it out there. I am like eight folks, eight members, not eight members, let me say I am eight people away from getting to 2,000 subscribers. Yes. Yes. And I only have you guys to thank. Thank you. Thank you for making it happen. You know, and like I said, it's this YouTube's always been a wild ride, but I understand what people want to see. What do you guys want to see in every video? You want to see the damn receipts. It's just, it's, it, you know, it's one thing to play these videos over and over again and talk about it, but without the actual receipts to show you guys to the new people that are coming in and replay crew, what's up, yo? <laughs> but to the new people coming in, I'm sure to you guys, you could take my word for it. I, I sound like a cool guy, and I am. I'll ask the, ask, ask the people here, but uh, I think I need to show the proof so I'm just not like every other creator out there that doesn't really show the stuff they have said. And there's worse stuff out there. There's a lot of worse stuff out there. I, I have a whole Google Drive somewhere that I still need to find of uh, their stuff. And believe me, it's as horrible as, as this. Your news, okay? You but thanks for subscribing. We have fun here at the crypt. To by its nature, I would say, is live streaming, uh, opinion and entertainment. That's what YouTube is by its nature. So if we're going to be entertainers, and even reaction channels are entertainment, definitely. Okay. It's for the walls, right? It's that's pretty much what. That's the reason you're going to get. From these people, why it's they not for the lulls. Okay, we want to make you laugh out loud. Okay, that's cool. That's what we want to do. What we don't want to do is be involved in your kids' lives. We don't want that. We don't want to be involved. Oh, thank you, Lori Angel. Zero one six four. Now I'm seven away. Thank you. That does help. That does help. Uh, thank you so much. Welcome to the crypt. We seriously do have fun here. And yeah, right. Oh, look, look, look what I found. Look, look what I found. Oh, what is this? A little, a little uh, well, Shani and Rev got kicked out of this apartment in Colorado before they moved into their bougie three bed, uh, three story condo. Um, back in 2019. They got kicked out because uh, Shani wanted, um, I don't know, Rev wanted to get a Baja Blast. They, Baja Blast. They were both super drunk. You know, it happens. And um, she uh, she beat Rev hard. And, uh, well, uh, the, the, the good people over at the Colorado police uh, saw it. And this is just some of that footage of Rev talking about where it hurts on his body.
So I, I'm sorry about the music. I was over there. So he says right here on his face, uh, and there on his other side, he's pointing to it. The police are taking pictures, just you know, just for a little uh, context of everything. They're taking pictures. You can guys even see from here how red that is. You know, Rev is not that red. And also, this is where he shows his arms and legs. Because Shaney took out the fetish whip and she got sloppy with him. Now, do you see that? Do you see that? Look at his leg. You, do you see that mark? I'm not even kidding. Like, I'm not. And Rev, is this taking it out of context? What, 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 what other context can I take this shit? You have a mark, a red mark going from right to left, and it's pretty big. She beat you. <laughs> Come on. Look at that, folks. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. There is no way. There is no friggin' way. So, but here, I'll, I'll keep letting them talk. In your personal life, unless we become friends, aside from this. We don't want to know these things about you because that's that's called boundaries. Okay, and and you'll say, oh, it's the internet. There is no boundaries. Yes, there are. It's called privacy rights. They still apply to the internet. Okay, that's God-given human rights. Covered in the in 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 what in one of the major amendments, the Bill of Rights. Okay in the Constitution of this great country. Now, let's start talking like a patriot. I'll be having Bill Cooper come out. I don't need that, though. I, I'm not going to preach at you about anything. I'm just telling Okay. Sorry. No, it's okay. Hmm. Ew. I, I, I don't know what that noise is. That That's grossing me out. <laughs> But while that's going on, let, let, if, if, if any of the new people here never saw the, uh, the, the, uh, the state of, of their Colorado home that they left in, folks, and that remember, take it from me, someone who just moved very recently, very recently, I did not leave my fucking home like this. It was bong on the floor, still. Like, uh, yo, no. No, all that stuff, if I didn't want it, it was at the curb, like a normal person. They just left this. Can you imagine? And can you imagine how that bed smelled? <laughs> yeah, well, I'm almost there, Senator. But yes, but well, thank you. And yes, and this this is oh well, my favorite. I can't have a bunch of just crap all over. Like I don't get this. There's no way. Bl and, like, clothes and shit. I, I don't get it. I don't get it. Right? It's kind. It's kind of nasty. Nasty. This ain't normal, folks. This is not normal. This is not, they're not normalcy people. I, how, there's no other context to take this. Oh, yeah. Um, this, they had a spice rack in, in their room, a whole box of Swiss rolls. They had a spice rack because they would cook in their room, in case you guys didn't know. And then the kids would bang on the door. Um, hold on. So, yeah. Uh, so they'd be making, uh, they'd be making, uh, well, what do you call it? YouTube videos, and then the kids would be all, and they'd be like, performance art, you know? No, you can't be in here, performance art, we're, we're making a video, get out, and then slam the door on them. Awful. Well, almost there, <laughs> Patty. Very close. But look at that. Nasty. Nasty. Ooh, ooh. That's some sick crap. I feel bad for the guy that had to lift his toilet. Uh, uh, sorry. <laughs> Trigger warning with the dirty toilet. Because you know they can't even throw a Clorox thing in there. And again... How else am I supposed to take that context? I don't know. Maybe you tell me. Maybe I'm all wrong doing this. Oh. Sandra Berger has just donated two euros through Super Chat.
Dude. Oh, I do. 2,000 subs bouquet partying face notice it. We L O V Y A. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me, let me look. Let me look. Now I have to look. Now you guys are making me look. Now I'm getting all crazy. Huh? Oh, there. Are. There's my video. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm actually there. Yo, I, I don't want to sound wimpy, but I almost might. I'm holding back tears right now. You guys have no idea. I th I thought if I would just even get to a thousand, uh, that would be great. I can get monetized and everything. But this, I got to 2,000 a lot faster than I got to my first thousand. But you know, that was me. I've I, I, I um, I'm been doing this video every other day or making a video every other day for months now. And wow wow i can't believe it well you know what that means folks what does that mean that means next stream is a 2000 sub celebration and hopefully with some special guests yeah we did it folks we did it i woke him up <laughs> Yeah, I, I just didn't think I didn't know when I was gonna get there. That's great. That is great. And I, I owe it all to you guys. Thank you. Thank you for sticking with me. I I am humbled and I appreciate it. Sorry. No, that's okay. Whoa, that's a mutilate. It's safe. What would they cook in the in the bedroom, Taylor? Oh my god, everything. Everything. Yo, they <laughs> Yeah. Um. <laughs> Who's mom? <laughs> oh, thank you. Uh, can it mean dreams? <laughs> sometimes I have those. Wait, what did I say? Um, is, you know, but sometimes they would actually, um, they would be cooking vegetables on the bed. To, on the bed. Yes. Yes, Cody. And you know what? I, I I understand that. I understand that from yesterday. There's nobody's going to give you anything. If any of you guys watch me right now, if you want a channel, you want to do this or anything in life, you got to go out there and get it. There ain't no spirit or God or anything that's going to give it for you. You literally need to go out and get it. It's all about hard work and persistence. And, you know, like this was well, since probably like the middle of last year until and now. Um, yeah, 2022, I started really ramping it up to when I got monetized, and it's just been great. And I really have you all to thank. So really, thank you. But yeah, he'd be, cook he be cooking vegetables and stuff. It was really gross. So uh, I thought he was going to burn the bed. <laughs> I, I made my point, but it's like I, at this point, I feel like I have to watch, you know, uh, Snoop Dogg's affirmation song every every morning. Like I need I need to be affirmed in my spirit that I am existing with my sentience, <laughs> that my consciousness resides in my body. Okay, this is Descartes shit. Do you know Descartes? I no, think please tell I us stuff. Okay, I think he's very relevant always. Like, oh, if you get deep into philosophy, people like to start reading Nietzsche. Why are you reading Nietzsche? He was, he was depressed, okay? He was an extremely depressed individual, Nietzsche, okay? And he has depressed philosophy, all right? All right? Descartes is child's play. I don't agree, okay? It's a very fundamental thing that it, when you're, de specifically when you're depressed, you might not like hearing Descartes. And Descartes said, I think, therefore, I am. All oh right. God. I have sentience. I have feelings. I have emotions. And my feelings matter. Okay. I get better every single day. That's what I need. I think I need to listen to that like every day in the morning because I have people that are trying to convince me that my own emotional state and my own feelings are not the truth. Oh, you mean like, um, let's see, you mean like here, 
Where, uh, I'm well, not here, sorry. Wrong one. You mean like here, where uh, Shani got arrested for beating you? Oh, and, and folks, uh, for the new people, uh, to the left, that like that's that's the guinea pig that froze to death, and all that is left, unfortunately, is the uh, dirty cage. Oh, and this is uh, June or July, and they still have their Christmas lights up and and their Christmas tree. And Shannon just has a load of dirty clothes on their uh, kitchen table. Really nice when you're raising two little boys. What? Am I getting arrested? So here's our options. If you're not comfortable watching, having him watch the children, we're going to have to call somebody else to pick them up. Am I being arrested? And again, where was the, if something happens to me, uh, my sister, my sister, my sister. Well, why didn't she get on the phone and call the sister, right? I, I don't, <laughs> I don't get her. Why doesn't he get arrested for her? Yeah, why doesn't he go? Uh, Liar! <laughs> why do you think, Shane? Because you did, because you did it, and he, he you have no marks on you. Wait, officer, why doesn't he get arrested for hitting me? Stand up. Can I go? Please. No, stand up. Please. Officer. Stand up. Right? Rip the guinea pig, exactly. Oh, I have five, bro, and I'm too big. And wow, look at her. She's like a linebacker, folks. Can you imagine her clotheslining a little boy? No. Even going after Rev, who is a, not even a quarter of her size. Yeah, she can barely do that. <laughs> so, okay, let's finish this up, folks. Of my feeling, which is crazy. That's not normal to try and do to someone. And that's my grievance. Like, my grievance is that. Uh, oh, crash. Uh, I guess you have to, what do you call it? Uh, I guess you have to try to turn uh, unsub and sub again and make sure the notifications are on. But I hear you. Sometimes, there's a lot of times I don't get notifications either. Best way is to check on, on the Discord because I usually show that I'm going to go live and, and just keep on checking back. I usually stream every other day because I get busy a lot, especially now. It's gonna be, I'm going to have a good month of putting shelves up and... I still have a bed to put together and a uh, an dresser <laughs> because a lot of stuff that we had from the old house had had mold on it because my uh, old landlord was a piece of shit, slumlord. But what's up, bro? Yeah, that's my grievance. Just stop trying to invalidate what I my my. It's as fundamental as you get to a person when they say, "Oh, hey, tell you, you hurt me." Because I've been guilty of this in, in fights or whatever. It, it's like you're not considering my feelings, what you're doing. I when 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 someone that you're close to says you've you you you've hurt me and then you just invalidate that and say, Well, I, I I'm not trying to hurt you, I'm trying to help you. Right. But I'm telling you that you hurt me. You didn't help me. I'm asking you to stop it. And my final plea is for you to repent to Jesus Christ and get saved because then you'll realize that Shani has the Holy Spirit and you shouldn't touch God's anointing. Oh. Figure that out. Oh. Yeah. You, you, know, you, you guys want to see the Holy Spirit? I think the Holy Spirit left something on the, on the toilet. <laughs> is that the Holy Spirit right there? Because I'm sorry. Trigger warning. But that is not the Holy Spirit. Okay? That's poo-poo. That is poo-poo. That is not the Holy Spirit. <laughs> okay. God bless you. And I have to wait for a little while because there's a delay. Peace. Oh, God, these two. <laughs> I, I, I like your shiny thank you. Thank you for what? I don't know. Um...
Yeah, I'm going to check to see if they made another one. I don't think they did. Uh, no. Rev Solo. Mm. No, I guess I could check this out for a little bit. I don't want. I I really want to just go into that video because I get it. I really need um, you know, to show you guys the receipts of all the bullcrap he says. Hello, everybody. It's me. It's Rev. I'm trying to oh, think thank of you. that because like when I do a live stream, I kind of like to have something to talk about. I'm surprised um, that it, it, it I'm, I was surprised that it was going to happen not today. What's going on in my mind right now. So I would probably just look at the chat for now and talk to you guys. Morning, don't skimp on the gravy. That's always good advice. Uh, uh, Kelly, yeah, yeah, Kelly. Um, well, as long as you don't try to monetize, you can be there. But when you try to monetize or if you do keep doing bad things, then YouTube can shut you down. I know a lot of channels um, that should not be here for, be, for ban evasion, for other stuff, but they don't monetize their channel. And if you don't, if you just kind of leave it out there in limbo, um, nothing will happen. But on the other side of the coin, I don't see them making any type of money here because they'll never get monetized. At least on Rumble, they could get monetized. Right, you know. Brady's good. How's everybody this fine morning? But yeah, I saw it. It's my first day. Of oh, I don't know. You're not going to see me much soon. Okay? So this is probably, uh, this this won't be a regular thing for me anymore. Yeah, we're kind of winging it, exactly. Auntie social media. <laughs> kind of winging it. Uh, if I were to talk about anything, it would be these un unidentified objects. And, and like, hmm. what, is it just all state acting things, or is there something more going on? Because that's really interesting to me at this point. Well, you know what? I will keep that one uh, for the next video, for my 2000 sub celebration, uh, where I could actually have my special guest come in, and hopefully he won't have um, anything else going on. I think this video is pretty good and self-contained. This way, if anyone sees it, they see that um, I kind of showed their lies and I debunked it everything with receipts, which she had to do. I know you guys like the videos more when I have all the receipts. Um, so what I'll say for now is uh, next stream will be the 2000 subscriber uh, celebration and hopefully I'll have some guests, but thank you all for hanging out and we will watch that unless something else comes on in the meantime but that's it guys thank you for sticking with me this whole time thank you for you know my rants and my craziness because i am just human like it like everybody else but i can admit when i make the mistakes and i think that's what most people want to hear with the uh rev and shanny but uh they don't get that yet but hopefully they do but on that note, thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you for uh, the super chats. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. Uh, I appreciate the replay crew. And one more thing. I need to make one more shout out to somebody for a cash app uh, on my last stream. Because uh, I didn't notice it until after. Oh, just waiting for it to come up. Oh, and thank you, uh, Mara. I appreciate that, Mara. Mara, thank you for the cash app. And uh, uh, Jewel, uh, Jewel Baby, thank you for the uh, cash app for Monday. I do appreciate that. So I just wanted to say that. So thank you guys for that. Thank you, Mods, for being awesome. Thank you, members. If you guys want to become a member, it's easy. It's in the description. And that's really it. On that note, I'll see you on the next time, guys. And always remember, ha ha. Bye-bye. <laughs>